Hi everyone, Josh Maddy here. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Welcome back to my channel. So um, I've been going through it, but I did actually pick up a couple pieces that I wanted to review as well as my Yeti bags that I need to review. And there's just a lot of stuff going on right now in my life. So I have to be very careful on what I spend my time on. But I'm between uh, classes right now for one day. So I'm gonna try to get as many of these things through as I can. So uh, the first one I got is this one. Uh, it's from Carhartt. And pretty much anything that a 12 year old girl wants is what I want, because I'm a Visco girl. <laughs> I don't even think people say that. That's so cringe. That's so chuggy. But anyway, uh, this is called the Carhartt Legacy Series Backpack Hybrid. I don't know if you guys can see that. So this one's really cool. You can use it as a tote, as a backpack, or as a shoulder bag, which is one thing that I have my Konkin stuff. I have a bunch of Konkin stuff because it's so durable. Um, but the tote pack, it's a backpack and a shoulder bag, but it doesn't have the option for a sling bag like over the shoulder or like a sling bag so this one does so it's got front and back um, back has the backpack straps which are adjustable and cool they have pretty durable metal here too which is really nice it looks like brass or something maybe not brass no one uses brass anymore it's metal um, front part has one zipper pocket and if you look inside it's almost got that kind of, same kind of feeling as like a Herschel bag where it has their signature pattern in it um, and on the other parts uh, there is this little uh, loop here and one I thought that was one up here maybe it's in the back so it does have this loop here and I'll go over that with you in a second there's two water bottle bo pockets but I don't know, it barely fits my hand in here, so it'd be very small water bottle or maybe an umbrella or something that you could put in there. Um, on the bottom it does look like it's reinforced and it has some squishiness here. And I'm assuming that is actually for the laptop pad, which I was very surprised it had because the Herschel version does not. Um, it has the double clips up here, so one button lower and one button higher. Because this bag is very durable, um, it does have those uh, I think it's brass, brass and probably stainless steel or something, but it has these um, so that you could either use it like this as a, a tote, like a regular tote handbag, or you can fold it down, snap it together, and then it's either a carry bag like this, or that's when the you, these adjust so you can pull them out pretty long and then do like a a full over sling body bag which I love because just that form factor that's why I got this bag because of that um, so I'll go ahead and show you the inside <clears throat> while I'm opening it I will say that this fabric here does feel like it's gonna get those little wispies of like uh, material or thread coming out all you do is take a lighter and lightly bop 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 or you could get like a shaver and just shave those little wispies off because I feel like that's what's gonna happen but it's super durable it feels like cotton or like a poly cotton blend or something um, so here's the inside of the bag um, on this first part here it's got another one of them snaps which is really great because that keeps your backpack in there or I'm sorry your laptop in the backpack and then inside it's got a padded laptop space which I'm very surprised about I was not expecting that um, on the other side of the bag in the lining there are two pockets and this material feels like waterproof or some kind of like poly cotton blend too um, but that's that that's all that's inside of this bag here you can see it's on the bottom nothing um, so that's that that's a very solid bag the zipper I do like a bag that can zip from both sides um, but this one does, sh it looks like it's like one of those waterproof or water resistant, water repellent zippers because of the way it's made. But I wouldn't dunk this. It's not a waterproof bag. It's water resistant. I think it even says that on the packaging, but just from how I feel it. Heavy duty poly with rain defender. Durable, durable water repellent. Hmm. Um, but yeah, it seems a very solid bag. I would recommend. I'll let you guys know after I've been wearing it because I literally just opened it today and like threw in a bunch of stuff. If you want to see, so this is my MacBook Pro. Um, it's like a 13 inch or whatever the basic one is. So I'll throw that in there. And there's still a lot of room in here. And it's got height room too, and it's like a dump bag because you don't have to leave the zipper open, or you don't have to close the zipper, so it's almost like a dump bag. You can literally just throw all your stuff in there. It's 
cute. And even if you close it with the laptop in, it can totally still work as that other kind of bag. So I'm guessing maybe there's a way you could attach this to your bicycle or something, because this handle, maybe this is the handle that's gonna bear the weight, but usually if they're gonna bear the weight, they usually come all the way to the bottom so that there's not so much weight on these stitches, which look really nice. This material, this material is great. I don't know what it's made out of, but it's really great. So uh, stay tuned for the next one. I love you guys. Peace. <laughs>